everybody. I'm Trey Bender alongside the former U.S. Women's National Team star, Kate Markgraf, also an NCAA All-American. Glad you're with us. Marquee matchup here. Today was a big deal for me for many ways. One, I got to come back to Notre Dame, which is something I always want to do in a commentator role. And secondly, I always want to do a men's game. And for the Irish? Well, this is a 4-4-2, and this typical Bobby Clark team, very organized and very compact, but when they break, they break fast. Number eight, Nick Beasler is the anchor of this team, and number 10, Harrison Ship is one of the lone returning goal scorers next year. Well, I have the opportunity to come back to Notre Dame and be able to announce a game, especially a men's game. It was just a very special time for me because that's one thing I've always wanted to do as now working in the TV world, is to come back and not as a fan and to cheer on you know, the women's team or the men's team, but to actually just come and watch the environment from a different perspective. So I feel very fortunate that the, it all comes around like a wheel. All of a sudden I started here and now I'm commentating games here. I still have a long way to go and it's nothing I ever thought I'd fall into, but I did because I have a stutter and a lisp, which you can definitely hear as I get tired or if I, um, I'm trying to remember somebody's name. I think I said Leon Brown. I went, Le 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 Leon Brown. What a matchup, one against four. Well, Notre Dame going into half was down one, I think, but they didn't give up. They inserted Leon, Leon, Leon Brown, and he has been the big difference in this game. Other than that, it's always room for improvement, but I like that. I like making mistakes, see where I can grow. A 1-1 final, number one against number four. It ends in a draw, but what a spectacle. Great showing here at Alumni Stadium. Well, this has been an excellent discovery process of where these teams are at for these coaches, and they just kind of identify what some of their strengths and weaknesses are. If you're Notre Dame, you have to be happy about your first showing in the ACC against the number one team. I think the goal for any commentator is get as many games as possible, and if I have the added bonus of doing it Notre Dame, it's just cherry on the cake. I just love it.